This is first person. This is third person. And this, well, th this is just the person. So, just some guy. I don't know. We've all played video games in third person that gives the ability to do whatever we want. <laughs> Even in Minecraft. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I am so sorry. This is the rig that'll allow me to live in third person with almost no lag or delay. And this is Lewis, the guy who built it. He's basically just me in a fancier font. And he's making sure I don't perish while filming this video. Oh. Can't do it like that. So the question's simple. What happens when you put a human in third person in real life for 50 hours? I'm going to puke. So naturally, the first thing I need to do is go get an epic outfit. Howdy, how's it going? Hey, welcome. Thank you. These are nice pants. Oh, these aren't pants. I really like the, oh, that's nice. After about 20 minutes of trying to find shorts in my size, I was ready for the changing room, sort of. I feel like this is a little bit of a video game. I'm like in a, in a room I'm not supposed to be in. Is my outfit fire? Hey, how's it going? Is that everything for you guys? That's gonna be it. This was my first and biggest mistake of this challenge. I shoved my wallet in Roger's face here due to my sheer lack of depth perception. And he looks furious, I think. He said he was gonna go outside and smash my subscribe button on my YouTube channel. He was actually super understanding and supportive and, and wish me luck. As I was leaving, I quickly began to notice my biggest weaknesses, doors, curbs, and my desire to pick fights with people. Give me some. <laughs> come, on, come on, like try. <laughs> oh yeah! There we go. You better watch out. Okay, I want some coffee. That's all I know. We found a coffee shop. It's outside. It's tiny. Let's go. Excuse awesome. me? Oh! Who said that? Oh, <laughs> howdy, I'm Ryan. Nice to meet you, I'm AJ. AJ, cheers. Obviously, well, where you at? There you are. <laughs> <laughs> Can I just get an iced coffee? Yeah. I'm starting to get a little nauseous, <laughs> you know. Yours is right in front of you. Oh, did you already put it there? Actually, oh, yeah, no problem. Perfect. Take a little sip, is there a lid on there? Uh, yes. Next, I'm gonna go play some basketball and I'm gonna challenge the first person I see to a game of pickup one-on-one. Any advice? Uh, the best advice I can give you if you're challenging them to one-on-one -on -one is yep. one, make sure they're not too tall. Okay. Looks like, oh gosh, looks like there's someone on the court. Excuse, oh my gosh, he just dunked it. How's it going? I'm Ryan. Dad, nice to meet you. <laughs> nice to meet you as well. I, uh, I was wondering, can I challenge you to a game of one-on-one? -on -one oh, wait, how tall are you? I literally can't tell. Six, eight. <laughs> you said six? Six, eight, yep. All right, well, Dang. I guess we gotta do this. All right, check. <laughs> I'm gonna have to create some separation, I think, is the, oh my gosh. That's game. <laughs> Good game, Zed. Yep. You going to the NBA, huh? Yep, that's All the goal, right. that's the plan. Uh, I'll, be, I'll, I'll be at your games. <laughs> I didn't find out until after, but he's actually probably making it to the NBA, so. <laughs> that's fair. There's a food truck over here, and I think it's about time we eat something. How's it going? How's it going? How are you? Cheers. Hey, excuse me, can you see what's on the menu? I can't read that from here. Me? Yes, I'm so sorry. I, I don't know where my eyes are right now. How far away am I from you right now? Four feet. Four feet. Easy. As I'm ordering my pulled pork sandwich, I'm realizing that I am not socially anxious or nervous whatsoever. Seeing myself in third person is literally making me feel like the most confident man of the 21st century. And we have this guy. I'm in third person right now, so I can see myself and you. How far apart are we right now? Uh, about five, I got it. Thank maybe you. six feet. Really? I thought we were like literally face to face. We're not making out. All right. <laughs> not yet. Not as good. <laughs> oh my gosh. Third person food hall. I'm about to pass out. Can't do it like that. We got a pulled pork sandwich here, guys. That's a lot of meat. Never heard that in my life. <laughs> Dude, this is really messing with my brain. This also makes me realize I need to maintain the back of my head. The hair is just all over the place. You there? Yeah. Uh, I thought you logged out. I can't see my mouth. Oh, he has aimbot. <laughs> no, I don't. Okay. So what are we doing next? It's come to that point of the day. It's time to check into a hotel. <laughs> are they walking in? Oh, sorry. <laughs> We're right behind you. <laughs> Voila, wow, the graphics. 
So the guy at the check-in desk said he subscribed to Dr. Phil, so I refused to put him on camera. If you're wondering why I put myself through this stuff, it's to pass Dr. Phil and subscribers. I've never had a grandpa before, and I want Dr. Phil to legally adopt me as his grandson. However, his agent won't let me ask him unless I pass him in YouTube subscribers. So for the time being, I'm at war with my own future grandfather. And the worst part, he doesn't even know it. Please help me. Please just subscribe. Am I good? Yes. All right. I do not feel like I've been in real life for at like the past eight hours. Like I'm actually just advancing in a video game rapidly right now. Like I just got a freaking crib. <laughs> this is sick. My hair looks ridiculous as well. Dude, it does. Dude, this literally feels like a video game. Lewis, I like you, but I don't like you that much. All right, I'll see you later. <laughs> we made it. Oh wow, we set up the camera beforehand. So artistic. <laughs> literally, so we got the bathroom here. Lewis? Come on, man. What? Oh, yeah, right. <laughs> Come on, man. <laughs> <Not bad. laughs> all right, dude. All right. all right, peace out, man. Ah, uh, yes. Why do I feel like I'm hiding from the cops right now? This world right here does not feel like for real. I'm starting to go crazy. At this point, reality felt so pointless that I tried figuring out like additional features to this thing. I'm not gonna sit here and act like I'm proud of where my imagination took me, okay? But after a few laughs, I got really nauseous. Oh, I'm getting sick. I need to close my eyes real quick. This is some sort of futuristic apocalyptic game where people start vlogging a non-real life, but I think it's about that time I order some pizza. <laughs> How do I order pizza? The next 20 minutes were comprised of me trying to figure out if I was holding a phone or a TV remote. Then I remembered there's a girl who can help me out. <laughs> hey Siri, call a pizza place, call pizza place delivery. Can I order a, a large pizza? Okay. Do you guys do delivery to the hotel room? Uh, no. Oh shoot, okay. I had exactly 25 minutes to figure out how I was gonna get to the lobby and get my pizza safely. Did you get a pizza by chance? Awesome, thanks so much. Yeah. Really appreciate it. You are going in my pocket. <laughs> pizza! You guys have no idea how much trouble I just went to to get that shot. No. All right. oh. Pizza! The pizza has arrived two hours later. It got pretty awkward in the elevator. Some guy walked in. Dude looked mystified. Doesn't help that I look like a part-time nurse either. Yeah, I couldn't believe my eyes either. There's three slices of pizza missing. I was checking the receipt and everything and I can't help but think that Dr. Phil's agent has something to do with this. What is this, some sort of inside job? <sighs> I don't, I don't know if this is my pizza. Nighttime routine. My microphone died, but I couldn't really tell because I can't see things properly. For example, that's literally skincare. I was about to brush my teeth with it. <laughs> but I found the toothpaste. We're good. And here I'm just talking about how they're gonna have to conduct another census due to the rapid population growth of acne on my forehead. So keep in mind, I can still only see through this camera on the rig. Like, this is what I'm seeing right now. But I had to take it off to go to sleep. What would you do if you looked up and for the first time in your life saw yourself from someone else's perspective with your own eyes. Coffee time. I hope that's where you put the water. Come on. There we go. Nice. One day I'll get a car. Goodness, my shadow looks horrifying. <laughs> ah, that's awful. Dude, if someone walked in, I would have no explanation. <laughs> Nausea, all time high. Had my eyes closed for what felt like hours. Is this what happens in video games when you log off? I tried walking it off, which doesn't make any sense because the nausea is caused by movement. I also briefly tried doing the Macarena, but honestly, that made it worse too. Unfortunately, I think it's time to tell Lewis that I'm throwing in the towel and I think he's gonna be really upset. Okay, Lewis, I bring you here today because I'm, I think I'm gonna quit right now. Oh, uh, yeah, go for it. 
You're not gonna try. You're not gonna try to stop me. Oh no, dude. Just like. Okay. Yeah. All right. Oh, this is gonna be so weird. Ah, I've only seen your face in like 144p for the past two days. Here we go. Oh. <laughs> oh, this is so strange. I feel like a failure. I don't feel well, actually. Well, at least I beat that guy in basketball. Yeah. 